Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we're going to be doing the um, try to do the whole drawing with just Crayola pens challenge. And I have a lot of Crayola pens here. There's about 64 and I just organized them in color so I could find the right ones when I needed them. So let's get started. So I started with the black one just to outline what I'm going to draw. And in case you don't know... I'm going to be drawing um, just watermelons on paper because I'm hoping that will be easy because I've never actually tried to draw um, with markers, let alone with Crayola markers. So here I'm just trying to figure out what to do. I would have definitely preferred if the markers were thinner, but they're not. So I guess I have to work with what I have. Don't forget to like subscribe and share so here i've done like the basic shape the outlines and then around the paper you're just gonna do a little watermelon scene seeds it just adds to the background and it looks really nice there we go just wherever you want it doesn't have to be like at the same place as mine okay so now i'm gonna go um start working on it with a really really dark green on the bottom at first I started off like making really thin lines but then I realized it would be better if it was thicker. So I just did that to everything. And then a lighter green. And you're gonna, um, I know I did it horizontally on here but you should do it like uh, vertically so making the lines going up like I'm doing right now. It actually turns out better. So that's what I did for the rest of them. And then you go with like a really light yellow. I really thought it would turn out like less brighter, but it turned out to be a bit too bright, but it that's okay, it doesn't really matter, it's just markers guys. So I did that to all of them, and then I'm going to go in with the red, and then I realized that um, watermelon is like a dark pink red, so I wanted to mix colors together, so I only used a little bit of red to start with. Um, so as you can see, I'm just starting to build in with the red. And then I'm going to go for the really dark pink. And then what um, I'm going to use it on top. And that's just going to mix in really nicely to make a slightly realistic watermelon color. There we are. That looks much better now. Just keep building into that. And then we're going to go in with the watermelon seeds. If you have a white pen as well, I actually didn't. But like you can add more detail to the seeds with a white pen if you would like. So I'm, I, I'm just going to do it to the rest of them now. I mean, this drawing isn't perfect, but it was kind of like my first time using Crayola markers because normally people don't use them. Even for drawing, normally people would use like um, special markers that you get for drawing. But yeah, I think it turned out okay considering that I only use Crayola pens. So now that the seats are done, the drawing is basically done too. I mean, if you want, you could also color the background, but I didn't want to waste um, the pens too much, so I actually didn't do that. And yeah, guys, that's basically it. As you can see, I only used like five colors. Oh, by the way, I also ended up using like a darker red, just to add more detail to it. Um, and yeah, that's basically it. As you can see, I have a lot of pens, so if there are any other like um, drawings you want me to do or try to do with just Crayola pens, let me know. Thanks for watching. Bye.